Hey, what is up guys? Welcome back. So, the month is of February is about to end. Um, it's basically going to be over tomorrow. I think in one day, 16 hours and 21 minutes, it's going to be over for me. So, I... I, uh... Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna try try one last time to get that dark mono with a square slot. So my 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 dark mono doesn't have a square slot. Um, you know, I really really just wanted like I, I wanted multiple dark monas, but I it, it was really really hard for me. So I think right now I'm just trying to <laughs> trying to get one last one. Hopefully, hopefully this one can have a square slot. Um, yeah, I'm, I'm I'm feeling a lot more okay-ish. Like I don't I don't care that much anymore. Like um, you know, if it if I don't get it, it's just it, it really isn't meant to be. Kind of sad about all the all the truffles I rebirth. Um, but I, I I don't regret it. Like it was it was worth it was definitely worth a try. You know. So um, what I'm gonna do is I'm going to probably start working on a replacement monster from our Dark Cult for for Dragon's V10. And I'm also going to be um, re-gemming some of these monsters. Like, I don't think I'm going to be using the Dark Gatito for for Golem's V10 in the, like, um, not, not right now. Like, I don't think I'm going to be using the Dark, um, Dark Gatito for Golem's V10 after I get my light team ready for Golem's V10, because I, I, I have my 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 snowy my July. Um, you know, I, I did rebirth all my Julys away. I could have made an e made this July Evil three, but it was it was definitely still worth a try. Um, and I'll eventually get them to Evil three again. It's it's definitely not going to be, be all that hard to get a July to Evil three. Like you can get the Julys from random summonings and stuff. So I'm going to be going back to farming golems um, and just getting eggs and also getting gems and just improving the quality of my gems for the next little while and I'm probably gonna work on one of these light monas um, I think the one with the Maybe I should use this one I should probably use this I should probably use this one um, yeah what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna work on work on one of my light monas. I'm gonna to try to put together a full light comp for for um for Golem Speed 10. It's gonna be a little bit hard to do. It's not gonna be it's gonna be all that easy. Um well maybe not a full light comp but like a mostly light comp. I'll I'll still use my Dark July because she is a really really good passive healer. But I'm I'm gonna use um I'm gonna use my snowy, my 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 light July and also my light Mona. I'm also thinking of, like, actually, if I if I have another attack on them, I might be able to do it with a light Victoria as well. But um, I don't think I have the gems. Like my my quality of gems aren't aren't that good to be able to do that. So um, so I'm think I th I'm thinking of just you know putting together alternative um, Golem Speed 10 team and then working on some dark monsters. Um, like another dark monster replacement also re-gemming my my Gatito. I'm planning to make him just full attack like just complete blast cannon um, and I'm gonna I'm gonna try like I, I think what I want to try is I'm I want to try using the dark sea star because um, I I mean these are these are pretty good gems but I can I can regem my dark sea star with a with a ruin set and I think higher crit rate and also, um, you know, do crit rate double defense basically. And I can give this set to someone else. Like, there's there's some other monsters that could use. I could use double defense and crit. Like, yeah, like the light Mona. I have one of my light Monas. Wait, where's my other light Mona? Wait, I have three light Monas. When the heck did I get three light Monas? I always thought I only had two. I'll probably raise this one then, because this one has a square double triangle, and I can just literally give the the same exact um, set that my Dark Sea Star has, and give it to this Light Mona. Well, 
yeah, I think that's that's pretty much pretty much all I can do to um, you know improve my 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 dragons and and giants runs. And what I'm thinking is I'm I'm gonna be you know since with the dark sea star I can have an extra extra um, extra 15% crit rate, and then I can pair that up with uh, my dark Gatito and I'm planning to basically take off this gem. I mean, this one does have 13% crit rate, but I have a pretty good attack gem, I think. Wait, or maybe I don't. Shit, I think I don't. Wait, I do, I do have one here, but I'm not sure where my other one went. Or maybe I never had it. Oh shit, no, it was a it was a diamond gem. Oh shit, uh okay this this is gonna be hard. Like it's gonna be hard because I'm gonna be losing 13% crit rate from this. Um It'll only really work out if if um if the the if this one powers up nicely, but then not sure if it's going to and I'm I'm on too much tilt to do it right now, so I'm 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 just gonna not do it. But I think my my new plan is to um, I'm I'm gonna be trying to not aim to clear dragons, like like perfectly, but I'm gonna be aiming to um, effectively always clear dragons within two two rev revives, because um, a, a lot of things a lot of the times what happens now is during the first turn. There's there's the light Persephone. I don't think the dragon dungeon is up anymore. No, it's the dark dungeon day today. Yeah, the dragon dungeon is closed. So there's like a light. The, the dragon's dungeon is like um, there's a light Persephone on the first level, and she's like the only one that has high enough resistance to resist my CC. So what I'm planning to do is um, I'm planning to like if possible like if I think most of the time I'm probably gonna have one of my units die to the light Persephone when she gets a turn. But I'm planning to, um, you know, at least be able to kill her the second turn or something like that. So I'm gonna CC one of the units. I'm gonna try to d defense break the light Persephone. Even if it doesn't land, I'm gonna try to do enough damage on her to at least do half of her HP, um, or maybe like a one third of her HP. And then the next turn, if my armor break lands. So basically, unless you resist my armor break twice in a row, um, I'll be able to kill her within one turn. And then one of my units is gonna die. And then after that, I'm gonna go in. And um, you know, because if I land armor break on her, my my dark Cadillo should be able to to one shot her um, with her, with his first skill. And then when I get to the second level, I'll revive once there, and then fill up my bar, and then one shot the dragon. You know, the next turn. And then if if everything works out like completely well, then I will be able to um, do it at least within two revives. You know, so. That's, that's just kind of my plans for dragon. So I'm planning to build everyone just full glass cannon and not um, not care about tankiness at all. So I'm gonna I'm probably gonna be taking off this defense gem from my my wood Gatito as well, and then putting putting in my attack one that I got here um, on my dark colt. And also for my my wild thing, I'm gonna probably go back to the original set, the one with like only 90% crit rate, but has like a lot lot higher crit damage and attack. I'm gonna use um, that set as well, and I think I think if if everything works out nicely, um, what I'm gonna try to do is I'm going to use try to try to gleam a lot of my my other wild things that I have around here. Also, I have a few wild things that are almost um, that I'm almost able to summon with soul stones. I just need like 20 more from these two, and I'm planning to like if. If the comp works really, really well, I'm gonna gleam both of them, and I'm going to um, wait. Let me let me just check how many gleams I have. I'm gonna gleam both of them, and also the the wood one that I have right now, and then just raise my wood wild fang to evil three. So I have one of each type of gleam and a lot of holy gleams. I'll start collecting um. I'll start collecting like maybe wood ones or fire ones. I'm not. I'm not too sure. I guess we'll start with fire again. We'll go fire again this week. And yeah, that's just that's just my plans. I just I just kind of wanted to share that with you guys. To share my progression and what I what I'm planning to do. Um, 
I don't know. I think I think what I'm feeling is a lot of relief. Like I I was trying so hard to get my dark Mona, um, but then now I'm just like it's right now. I'm just feeling whatever. Like you know, if I if I don't if I get it, that would be really great. But if I don't, then it's still not the end of the world. Um, and and yeah, I just um, start working on some 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 new comps and stuff. So. Um, I forgot to say this, but what I'm going to do for for my rebirth is I'm going to wait for tomorrow, and at the, on the very very last moment, like you know, when there's only a few, maybe on the last hour or something like that, um, or if I completely given up before that, then I will I will do all my summons um, and then rebirth everything that I can rebirth, and then that'll be it. Like that'll be. That my last try for the Dark Mona, um, and if it if it works out, then it'll be great. If it doesn't, then it's it's still whatever, right? So yeah, that's pretty much it. Um, thank you guys so much for watching. I'm gonna go I'm gonna go back to farming. I'm gonna try try really hard to farm as many monsters as I can um, during this time, and I'll yeah I'll be seeing you guys be seeing you guys in my last and final rage summoning video um that's pretty much it thank you guys so much for watching um peace out